Hi friends, welcome to the next video of Let's Understand Our Planets. Before heading towards the video, let me remind you, there is a playlist created on this video that I'm coming across in our planets in the top corner. Go through it and view the information about the previous planet that I've come across and not only that some other videos that is there in my channel so here in this video we'll be learning about the planet Venus Venus is the second largest planet from the Sun and the sixth largest together with Mercury there they are only the planets without a satellite even though mercury is closer to the sun venus is the hottest planet as we had learnt about mercury's profile now here we have venus with its profile the diameter of venus is 12104 kilometers the mass is 48.67 into 10 raised to 23 kilograms it again has no moons 10 crore 82 lakhs 9475 kilometers the orbit period of venus is 224.7 earth days the surface temperature of venus is 462 degrees celsius so high the first recorded it was first recorded on 14th century bc again by babylonian astronomers now let us come across the facts about the planet venus the hottest planet venus doesn't have any moons or rings as it is similar to mercury now venus is the hottest planet in the solar system A day on Venus is longer than a year. Venus spins clockwise on its axis. Venus is the second bigger, brightest natural object in the night sky after the moon. Venus is named after the Rom Roman goddess of love and beauty. Venus was the first planet to have its motions plotted across the sky as early as the second millennium BC. Venus is sometimes referred to as the morning star and the evening star. Now let us have a comparison of Venus and our mother earth. Earth is 1.05 times bigger than Venus. Its equatorial radius in kilometer 6 is 6052 for Venus and 6371 for Mother Earth. The volume of Venus and Earth in cubic kilometers. For Venus, it is 92,841.53 crore cubic kilometers. For Earth, it is 1,8320.69 crore cubic kilometers. Venus is almost similar to the volume of the Earth that is 1.16 times. The surface gravity meter per second square for Venus is 8.87 and for Earth it is 9.81. That means a man with 100 kg weight on the Earth will have only 90.7 kgs in Venus due to less gravities. Now one day and one year comparison of Venus and Earth. For Venus, one day equals to 243 Earth days. For Earth, it is just 24 hours. In Venus, one year is 225 Earth days, but in Earth, it is 365 days. A day and a year in Venus is almost same duration. Now, about satellites. Again, Venus has no satellites, but Earth has one natural satellite, that is our moon. Mercury and Venus are the planets which doesn't have satellites. It's already informed, but it's a revision for you all. Now, 
Now, did you know, being very close to the Earth, Venus was observed by Asian astronomers from different cultures many times. However, the first accurate observation was in 1610 by Galileo Galilei. Though it can easily be seen, its surface is hidden by thick clouds. Thus, it was for a long time believed that it was similar to Earth. Venus reflects 70% of all the sunlight it receives, which is why it shines so brightly. Venus has the slowest rotation of any planet, making it is the most spherical object after the Sun. Venus has mountains, valleys, and tens of thousands of volcanoes. The highest mountain on Venus, Maxwell Montes, is 20,000 feet high. That is 8.8 .8 kilometers, similar to the highest mountain on Earth, Mount Everest. It is the most visited planet of the solar system with over 40 spacecrafts exploring it. The temperature on Venus doesn't vary much between the night and day. The atmospheric pressure of Venus is 92 times stronger than Earth's. Venus is the closest planet to the Earth. Now here we have done with Venus. One request to you all that if you have any more information regarding the planet Venus which is not put up in the video, I welcome you to come up with those information in the comment section and come up with some more facts that you can share with the people around you. Thanks once again but stay tuned to come about to our mother earth the next planet very excited to know about it join with me in the next video to learn about the planet earth thank you